Hello everyone, today we are here to play Evolve, one of the best multiplayer games I've ever played, in my opinion, I think it's really good. Um, this series is going to mainly focus on showing the pros and cons of each individual hunter, and showing how they are vital to the mission. And then ultimately, we're going to be playing as the monster itself. Um, we're going to try starting off with the Assault. And from there, we'll move down this line and show you every three different characters of the hunters. And then we'll finally get onto the monster. Alright, let's get in it. Hello, everybody. Today, we will be reviewing Markov, the first assault within the whole Assault Hunter classes. And, um,. He has a lightning gun, an assault rifle, and an arc mine, and of course a personal shield, just as every other uh, assault does. And we're going to put jetpack recharge 55% quicker, because if you can't fly, you're going to die. And uh, looks like we're going to be playing Orbital Drill on Hunt, very nice map. And it's always interesting to see what our friendly hunters pick. Looks like we just got a trapper as well. Uh, Markov is a really funny guy to listen to. The cutscenes with this guy are pretty funny. I remember one time he said, My blood? And, Medic! Like, he was so surprised to see that he saw his own blood because he's like this big, tough, awesome guy. But it was funny at the time. Max, how long were you alone on Factor before you got off? Two years. Holy shit, two years. God damn. I don't want to be here two weeks. <laughs> Time Jeez, flies man. when hey. you're running for your life. At least you had Daisy. There were more of us. Only Daisy and I made it. Ooh, that's Long tough. Time tough, tough. To reach the I'll have to figure out how to turn it on. Dang. You got the Nordita evac ship running all on your own? Yep. Well, goddamn, I thank you. All right, looks like we only have someone playing the support. This is okay. Hopefully, someone joins in on the medic. You always want real people instead of AIs, or I think they're better. It depends if they know what they're doing. Oh, Daisy looks like she knows what she's doing. Uh, we're gonna have to track this beast quick. Always want to get the monster as quick as you can. Now, see, with the um, assault, you're able to. If you want to, you can go ahead and track the monster by yourself. Because, well, not too far from your team, of course. But out of all the people equipped to hunt this monster, you're pretty good because you have a personal shield. Shield that guarantees you like maybe five, ten seconds before the monster breaks through, and you're able to actually hunt this guy down before. Um, before you you can like separate from your team and cover more ground that way instead of just following your team the whole time but I'm gonna go ahead and play safe and just follow Daisy for now because it's still the beginning we don't have that much to worry about when he starts getting to stage two and it says that he's already evolved that's the problem okay here he is wow okay we got him real good so here we're using the assault rifle very good for long-range shooting uh, it does a lot of damage, especially when they got the dime times two on it by medics or anything that does have damage amplifying. See right there, it gives it a 1.5 damage. Currently, we have Lazarus, so he does 1.5. But um, I'm gonna run away from the monster a little bit and pick out this gun. Now, this is the electricity gun. The thing about this gun, it's really good and locks onto him, but you have to have your reticle on him, which is the little thing in the middle, or else it wouldn't work. And he seems to be charging. We're gonna go ahead and dodge that. Let's go ahead and hit him with the assault rifle. Now, this is cool because you can switch from your assault rifle to your lightning gun. But your lightning gun does way more damage. You always want to use this gun. Now, see here, he's trying to kill me. We're gonna turn on our personal shield. Go right at him. Show him that we're the man of the we're man of town. Okay, he seems to be attacking the support. Oh, attacking is a bad word. More like killing. Okay, now that I was. The trapper shield just ran out. Okay. 
Alright, this is bad. It seems that our team has gotten down. The medic has been able to revive Hank with invisibility on. I mean, Hank has the invisibility thing on. It is good, good, good. It'd be really good if Hank did an orbital strike on me. That always helps. It doesn't seem he's able to. Uh, kind of is. Okay, awesome. It looks like we're going to be able to win this. With the assault and the medic, it's a very dangerous combo. You got to knock them both down. Make sure the other one's down too. This Goliath so doesn't know anything. He's getting whooped. He's scared. He's running. He's trying every move in his arsenal. We're knocking him down. Uh, well, if this match just end right now, because it looks like this Goliath is going to take it, we will, I'll, I will be demonstrating the Arc Mines in the next match. But, um, oh, he looks like he's trying to get away. We're going to see if we can cut him off here. Okay, there he is. Now, he thought that he could try sneaking up on me. Okay, he's very mad at me. He's like, Assault, it is all your fault. But no, I must take him down. Okay, he seems to be trying to run away. We're going to get him with our long range kind of assault rifle. Uh, oh, where'd he go? Uh-oh. I did not see where he went. Okay, he went over there. We're going to go ahead and tell our team that he's over there by marking the waypoints for them. Okay. We're going to go ahead and go this way. My health is very low, as you can see. The Goliath could take me out in one hit if he wanted to. So I must be careful. Um, no visual on the Goliath, though. That's strange. Oh, he must have doubled back to Hank and Daisy. Okay, thank you, Medic. Now, if this monster does get all his armor again, that's bad. But hopefully he doesn't get the albino regen perk, which regens your health. That's even worse, but... That was a pretty good fight. We got him down all the way to his last health bar. We're getting in our, um, I think it is support. No, Trapper. See how Daisy's not moving? That usually means that the Trapper's dead. She can't move without her, her like, I guess, guardian telling her what to do. But that's, that's kind of cute. Um, I guess we're going to have to track this solo style. Stage 2. Only bad thing is it gives you more health. That's, yeah, that's kind of bad. We're going to have to track him down as soon as we can. Oh my god, that thing does not look friendly. I'm going to want to stay on a rock because I'm, 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 even though I'm the assault, the guy that looks like he can't even get harmed, I can. If it bleeds, it can kill it. So I got to watch out. No. I'm waiting till the trapper gets in here because without Daisy, it's kind of hard to track this monster. But he seems to leave a lot of tracks around, but maybe he's just deceiving us that way. I've seen various tracks, but not leading in one pivotal direction. They're all going in there, there's one going over there. The monster can play his game smart. And you just gotta figure out the monsters, the way he behaves, and see if you can track him down that way. Uh, it looks like we just got some birds. Um, wow, he was really close, actually. Jeez, right underneath our noses. One thing that I noticed about this Goliath, he's very sneaky. He's right there, by the way, if you didn't see that. There he goes, trying to jump. He's very sneaky. Okay, we're gonna... Hopefully he jumps down here. No, he's running away like a smart guy. You always want to fight the fight when you're strong, not weak like him. Currently he's weak. But, um, that sucks. We're gonna try to catch up to him. Okay, this was the support, I'm pretty sure. He was right next to him. It was a good thing that he didn't even get caught with his blast. Now, one thing I wanted to point out is that the mistake that a monster always makes is leave the support alive. The support may seem like the least advantage towards taking down the monster, but he is pivotal to running away and hiding, and so we can spawn back in the airship. He he has the team invisibility cloak, which makes the whole team invisible. And he's able to use that to get away from his enemy, which is the monster, which is awesome. Always helps out. Now, this monster seems to be really sneaky. So we gotta watch out. He can pounce on me. Uh, seems to... S okay. Someone's putting him... Okay. Um, he's just... He should be right here, then. Right? No. Wow, this Goliath moves fast. Oh, he's right there. Okay, sorry. I got a little bit excited. He thinks he's sneaky, but he's not... 
Yeah. What's up, my friend? All right, we're gonna go. Oh shoot. Oh wow. Okay, that was Hank's orbital strike. One of the awesome things that I've ever seen, but that clearly didn't help us there. Should have waited to a uh, better moment to use that, but it's fine. Um, I'm surprised the trapper hasn't thrown the thing yet, which is very weird. But we're gonna go ahead and make him want to leave. Because he does not want to be in our arena right now. Who are they killing? They're not killing... He's, I think... Yeah, he's killing the trapper. So he can't be trapped. I mean trapped. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, he seems to go ham on us. He doesn't want us alive. He sees that the support is healing me with his, um, not healing me, giving me a shield, rather. He's a pretty smart guy. I'm gonna have to keep on chasing this guy. I'm gonna take out my Sarko, get a few hits on him before he runs away. Now, even though we got him back to one bar, this is good. He's at that other point that we just had him at. And if he's not as... Okay, there he goes. Oh, there, I, don't, I think that was him. You, you get to see the monster for a glimpse when you run over a rock. You gotta be very quick. Um, but yeah, now that we got him back at one health bar, we have a very good chance of succeeding. Even though he does get all his armor back, it's still really hard, really, really hard to overcome that. See, even now, he bur uh, he he left three of us alive, which is pretty good. The medic revived everyone too, because he's Lazarus, so he was able to bring back the dead. Amazing, amazing. Okay, seems like our teammate here is getting down. I don't know if he got down or something's attacking him. Whoa, 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 something's attacking us, I know that. Okay, that guy was not nice. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, I hear the monster. Okay, looks like we got the monster in place. Oh, seems as if the monster wasn't in here. Now, one thing I want to point out is with these arc mines, I think they're called. Uh, they should, yeah, I think they're called arc mines. The thing with arc mines, the the assault's really good for things such as waiting for the monster, or not. This specific assault is. He's more better at waiting for the monster and having the trapped for him. Uh, for example, let's see here. The monster moves around the map, so what you can do. Oh wait a minute. Uh, I'll explain it in a second. We just need to get this monster down to a lower health. He seems to have gained all his armor back. Uh, I don't know what perk that is. I think it makes you move quicker though. Which is bad. Alright. Uh, we're getting him down. Lazarus is trying to revive him. He should just wait till he dies. But good old Lazarus doing the good old thing. Now what's really good here is the monster doesn't see me up here. And I just basically took down a bunch of his health. Uh, here we go. We're going to kill him. This is it. I'm tired of you, monster. You need to go ahead and get in the grave. Get out of here, man. You're not you're not falling around here. Get out of here. Alright, we got him down to even lower health standards. Wow. Uh, if I can, I'm trying to shoot him from over here, which is a big problem. Okay, back to what I was saying. I'm so sorry, guys. This monster, he's, he's pretty good, I gotta admit. He's able to try to hurt us but run away at the same time um, it's pretty good but uh, what I was trying to explain earlier is with these arc mines they're good for traps and maybe possibly waiting for the monster maybe at stage 3 when the monster has to come to the generator you can leave a bunch of these lying around see now the generator he usually goes to the power relay now what you can do is since he runs around the map you can kill a random wildlife and leave an arc mine on top of it there you go. He will. He will probably step on the arc mine while trying to eat that animal. He's like, "Oh, free animal!" He will probably eat it, and then there you go. You get a free hit on him. It's not a bad deal. Uh, okay, I need to get beyond that missile strike. Okay, this is good. All right, cool, cool. He barely got his health back. That's only three bars. I could take that away. It doesn't it doesn't worry me. It seems like we're gonna try getting together as a team again try to get closer now monster likes okay there's two ways he can come from to get to that power relay but i'm gonna take my chances and say he's gonna come from the front 
just because he's the monster and we'll see him from far away if he does come the other way I'll lead him here now this is what is called like the death trap right here you get him in a full like uh, two by two grid of mines and he'll blow up all of them what a damage dealer it will deal so much damage to the monster I don't know approximately how but maybe if I had a guess two to four armor points bars I mean my bad especially with two damage on him it's just so bad. Here he goes. Did you see that, ladies and gentlemen? Wow. Look at that. Almost all his armor gone. Now, he seems to be trying to take me out. What I can do is I can put on my shield. Get him distracted for a while so my teammates can revive my other one. There we go. Now, this is the way you play. You gotta play as a team. Looks like I just died. We're gonna want to get the medic to revive me. I think he's gonna try uh oh okay the medic just died that is not good news whoa, whoa, whoa holy crap okay that was a real turn I gotta admit the medic should have not played that way that was a very bad idea I like what the support is thinking oh my sir please put on your cloak please okay he might throw okay there we go he got out of okay all he has to do is get out of his range okay looks like the other guy's still alive oh no he did not take the chance to run I would have so ran okay this is weird I'm scared we got literally the monster at one health bar now it depends if he goes for Daisy if he goes for Daisy that's even better because he will okay he's going for Daisy he's losing even more time to attack the power relay the power relay is both a magnet for the monster and the hunter. If the monster begins to attack the power relay, the hunter automatically has to say to himself, I need to hit him, so he stops attacking. He seems to have taken Daisy down all the way. He lost 20 seconds doing that. Seconds or seconds, it's all valuable in the time. Uh, okay. Hopefully, I don't know how this guy's going to pull it off. He can go shoot him at the power relay and then cloak. That's my that's my choice I would give him. And um, he seems to be wasting his time. Come on, guy. Go over there. Go over there. What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. He just wasted his cloak. What? Okay, maybe he just wanted that. I don't see the reason for it, but... Because we're not alive yet. Oh, my God. I think that monster might destroy the whole power relay before he even gets there. Okay, let's see if we even get a chance at this. We might not even drop out of the ship unless the support deals some damage to that guy. Oh well. The the support did not play that smart. He almost had it, but unfortunately at the end he went for the the greed. Oh well. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is Markov. Really good hunter, in my he's a really good assault in my opinion. He has the lightning gun, the arc mines, and the assault rifle. And you guys saw a line of arc. Look at that. I think that was all from one 2,000 damage, that one line. That was just amazing. We took down so much of his armor. I suggest you guys try that out with Markov. And um, thanks for watching. Oh, excuse me. Thank you for watching. Bye.